Ollie, welcome to Norwich. This is the first time we've had a chance to chat to you here on Canaries Player. Um, just tell us a bit about how you came to join Norwich. You came in the summer, is that right? Yeah, I came in the summer on trial for two or three weeks and um, did really well. So they offered me a contract. And it was really good. And you, you played a few games again, again on some local pitches. I mean, it was, was it difficult? Are you pleased to get pleased to get the deal in the end? Yeah, yeah, really pleased. It was. It was, really, it was different because I'm used to, you know, not really used to playing on those kind of pitches, but got through it and did myself justice in the end. Yeah. And a bit about yourself, can you tell us a bit about your career so far? You, you joined us from Spurs, is that Oh, right? yeah. Um, I was at Tottenham from the age of seven and then went right the way through the academy, right the way through to my scholarship season. And then, unfortunately, I didn't get a contract at the end of the season. And then I had a year out of football, well, not a year, like a couple of months out of football, where I had to really find myself and find myself now, and I'm here. Excellent. And happy to be here. How, yeah. how much are you enjoying Norwich so far? Um, have you settled in? I've re at the beginning, it was hard because, you know, being away from family and all sorts, but I really enjoyed it. Like, it's a really nice area, really quiet and not hectic like London, you know. It's good to be away from everything. Yeah. So all your family are back in London? You're yeah, a yeah. Boy, yeah, London boy. So, London so boy. it's a real change coming yeah, into no. Norwich. Who are you? Are you staying in Diggs? I'm um, staying sort of like a Diggs. Yeah, yeah. I'm staying with one of the players, Adele. So it's really good. Yeah, and a bit about yourself as a player. Uh, you, you're you're a central midfielder primarily, but yeah. you've been employed in quite a few different positions so far. Um, well, the thing with that is because I can play in so many positions. At Tottenham, I played right back, centre half. Centre midfield. Where did I play? I played everywhere. Started up up front, drifted into midfield. <laughs> I played everywhere. I played everywhere. I don't really, I'm not quite sure of my position sometimes. Yeah. I lose myself. Well, that's the first start. That's, that's a good quality, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. And the, the coaching as well so far. Norwich are having a big push for Category One status in mm. the Elite Player Performance Plan. You've been working a lot with, with Scott Marshall. How, how are you finding working with him? And is he helping to develop you as a player? He's a great coach. Great coach. I thought. When I left Tottenham and I came here, I weren't really sure because I'd been at Tottenham for so many years. I weren't sure if the training was going to be any different or would I be just running. And but it's all ball, it's all football, it's all keeping the ball in the deck. Like he likes me to get go and get the ball and do my bits and pieces, run around, make tackles. Like he really gives us freedom to express ourselves, and I really enjoy it. You mentioned Spurs. Are you there for a few years? We did you were you there when Chris Hewitt was there? Um, yeah, right at the beginning. Um, I remember seeing him actually when the old training ground, so I was I think about nine, ten years old, and we used to train at the stadium in a ball court. And I remember coming out and seeing him and shaking his hand and getting his autograph. It was many years ago. Um, somewhere in my house. <laughs> Yeah. Probably quite tell him that. Yeah. Um, and, and now at Norwich, uh, I mean, the, this coach Scott Marshall said that there's a great team spirit in the squad, and that's shown with some great results on the pitch. Yeah. A lot of new lads came in at the start of the season. Really, really getting on well with each other. Oh yeah, it's a really good group. Really, really. I thought at the beginning I didn't think we'll click as well as we have done. Like it's been so much. It's just been a laugh right from the off. Like you can never stop smiling. There's no there's no arguments or everyone's like, really in it for each other. Really good. Uh, and you had your first taste of senior cup action against Deerham Town on, on, a, on a cold and windy night yeah. at Old East Park the other week. How, how did you find that? It was a tough one. You know what? My, my first five minutes was a big shock because I got lifted up in the air. Like it, was a, it was real men's football, real tough, physical, in your face. I really enjoyed it. Yeah, and, and the replay obviously coming up in December, that, that'll be at the FDC. Is that, is that something you look forward to? Yeah, yeah. The final, final being at Carrow Road, a chance, a chance to play there. You've already played there. Yeah. How do you find that? What, playing at Carrow? Yeah, yeah. Oh, really enjoyed it. Like the bars, the chain, the tra um, uh, changing in the change rooms, walking out onto the pitch, you know, big pitch, big. Oh, it, was, it was amazing. It was amazing. Really amazing. And the season so far has, has been amazing for the, for the 21s. They start, we're still pushing for that third place mm. in the league. I mean, are you, are you pleased with your own performance and that of the team so far? No, extremely. Like, um, it's, been, it's been good. Like, to start off the way we have done and then find, like, start to, you know, teams have started to find their feet. And, but I think it's really good. Like, 
the fact that we're just a new group and we've done as well as we have done to get where we are. Like, no one could have imagined this, like, us being where we are now.